Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. In this video, we are going to have uh, some discussion about MCQs regarding bioenergetics with reference to preparation of NMDCAT 2021 paper. Question number one Which of the following are similarities between the structure and function of mitochondria and chloroplast? They have internal proton gradients by electron transport chain but they do not generate co2 collectively because you know co2 is produced only by mitochondria and chloroplast make use of use of it they both have an outer membrane and an inner cristae outer and inner membrane is found in both but cristae there the characteristic of mitochondria only they both can survive independently no they cannot survive independently actually so question number two the photosynthetic pigments of plants are arranged as clusters in the hyalocyte membrane the reaction center of these clusters consists of chlorophyll molecules and that is chlorophyll a which is the main part of reaction center question number three spectrophotometry is used to measure absorption of different wavelengths of light by a pigment delta and the location of phytol tail of chlorophyll a is thylakide membrane instead of lumen or stroma as you can see over here the chlorophyll a molecules they have suspended phytol tails in thylakide membranes all of the following are differences between chlorophyll a and b except Chlorophyll A has different types, while chlorophyll B is a single type. Yes, it is a difference. Chlorophyll A has functional group methyl, but chlorophyll B is having aldehyde. Yes, it is also a difference. Chlorophyll A is a necessary pigment. Chlorophyll B is the accessory pigment. Yes. And chlorophyll A is present in antenna complex, while B is in the reaction center. We know that it is a wrong statement because chlorophyll A is found in reaction center as well as in antenna complex. So right option will be delta. As you know, these are some of the differences between chlorophyll A or chlor and chlorophyll B. End product of yeast fermentation, bacterial fermentation and aerobic respiration, they are ethyl alcohol, citric acid, sorry, lactic acid, carbon dioxide gas and water in aerobic respiration. And yeast as well as bacteria, they produce alcohol as well as lactic acid during fermentation or anaerobic respiration. Which part of chlorophyll molecule absorb light? It's definitely pore firing or head region of the chlorophyll that absorbs light. Question number eight. Which of the following color is maximum absorbed by chlorophyll? It is red out of these colors. As you can see, there are two absorption peaks formed in blue range as well as in the red range. Some photosynthetic organisms contain chloroplasts that lack photosystem too. Yet they are able to survive. The best way to detect lack of photosystem too in these organisms would be to test for the liberation of oxygen. Because if they are producing oxygen, definitely they are not having uh, they, they are having photosystem 2 but if they are not releasing oxygen they are without photosystem 2 because we know hydrolase enzyme hydrolase enzyme that produces photolysis uh, oxygen by photolysis is associated with photosystem 2 only so right option will be beta the molecule regenerated by fermentation is nad positive and the final acceptor of electron during non-cyclic electron pathways, NAD pos NADP positive. Chlorophyll consists of a head of four pyrrol rings and a phytol tail. And that is also known as four firing head and a phytol tail. Delta is the structure of chlorophyll molecule. And the stage of cellular respiration producing maximum ATP is electron transport chain or you can say chemiosmosis during 
respiratory chain so delta and an immediated oxidation without decarboxylation citric acid cycle takes place during the conversion of malate to oxaloacetate otherwise co2 is also released with nad at other stages it's the stage during which nadh is formed without release of co2 otherwise wherever during krebs cycle nadh is formed co2 is also being released at those stages what splits during photosynthesis on interior space of thylakite and that is photolysis associated with photosystem 2 over here and it is taking place on the interior side of thylakite number 16 which of the following types of mammalian cell does not carry out oxidative phosphorylation they are erythrocytes because they are without mitochondria and they carry out phosphorylation that is uh, actually not oxidative that is actually substrate level phosphorylation which is being carried out in erythrocytes during glycolysis how many molecules of atb would be utilized for phosphorylation of one glucose molecule during glycolysis obviously there will be two atb molecules which are required during preparatory phase glycolysis produces atp by substrate level phosphorylation and what is the role of NADH in the process of cellular respiration? NADH is a nucleotide source for the synthesis of ATP during respiration. And the electron carried by NADH and FADH2, they can be moved between proteins in the inner membrane of mitochondrion to generate a gradient. And then they can be this, uh, that gradient can be used to generate ATP. The colors of light that are most effective for photosynthesis are red, blue, and violet as compared to other ranges. So alpha. During Z scheme, photosystem 1 functions to restore an electron to its reaction center. And photosystem 2 functions to gain that electron from water. Because photosystem 2, it involves photolysis as well. Kellen cycle is also known as C3 pathway due to production of C3 carbon in the form of 3 phosphoglyceraldehyde that is the first stable product of Kelvin cycle. And the overall flow of electrons in the light reaction is from water to NADPH. And when electrons flow along the electron transport chains of mitochondria, which of the following changes occur? The pH of the matrix increases. Because hydrogen ions, they are being pumped out of the matrix. And when there is high concentration of hydrogen ions, there is low pH. But when there is low concentration of hydrogen ions, we know there is high pH. So pumping out of hydrogen ions from the matrix causes increase in pH of the matrix. As you can see over here, electrons, they are being pumped towards lumen or lumen of Christi, or you can say intermembranous space. That's why matrix becomes lower in hydrogen ions and pH increases. Most CO2 from catabolism is released during citric acid cycle. As you know, there are two sites during which CO2 is being produced. The greatest contributor of electrons to the electron transport chain is citric acid cycle or Krebs cycle, which produces maximum NADH as well as uh, an FADH2 molecule. The immediate source that drives ATP synthesis by ATP synthase during oxidative phosphorylation is hydrogen and concentration across the membrane holding ATP synthase. This gradient is responsible for the generation of ATP which cause movement of hydrogen ion across this pump and ultimately ATP is generated. Which of the following is the site of oxidative phosphorylation in mitochondria? It's definitely Christi or inner membrane. So right option alpha. 
how many molecules of ATP would be utilized for phosphorylation of one glucose molecule during glycolysis? Two molecules will be required in the preparatory phase. And then terminal electron acceptor in the electron transport chain is oxygen. While the direct source of energy for the ATP product produced by ATP synthase comes from protein, a proton gradient, beta, and thirty three. Why is fermentation? Uh, why is fermentation an important metabolic function in the cells? Because it generates uh, it oxidizes NADH to NAD positive to regenerate NAD positive for the next reaction. And how does reaction center of photosystem 1 regain an electron during Z scheme? Photosystem 1 gains this electron donated from photosystem 2, while photosystem 2 gains this electron via from water via photolysis. And the last question is increase in concentration of NADPH and decrease in ATP level stimulate cyclic phosphorylation. As you can see over here, it moves the electron from ferredoxin to the plastoquininocytocom complex for the regeneration of the cycle so delta thank you so much that was all about mcqs of bioenergetics